What is going on, guys? Welcome to Gregel's TV Daily, your source for daily tech news. Make sure you subscribe so you know what's going on in the world of tech. As you can see, I am off location. I'm not in my office right now recording my videos. I'm actually in a hotel room in Salt Lake City, Utah. Uh, Google brought us out here, at least a handful of us. Um, and we're actually able to watch all the all-star game, NBA all-star game festivities, the dunk contest, a bunch of fan stuff, uh, the all-star game itself. So I'll be out here till Monday morning. Um, so you'll see my videos from here. Uh, I'm not going to answer any questions because it's like these days are actually, even though it's just the all-star game festivities, <clears throat> it's pretty busy throughout the day. And um, so, yeah, and we only have one story anyway today. Anyway, the story is all about One UI 5.1, which has launched with the Galaxy S23 phones, and it's been pretty good on S23 phones in terms of like battery life, and I haven't really noticed any bugs too much on my phone, maybe you have, I personally haven't really, but what about One UI 5.1, because it has been also released on a bunch of other phones, in the S21, uh, S22 phones, um, I think some people on the Z Flip Fold 4 got, I could be mistaken on that one, but I, people have it that don't have the S23 phones. How is it doing in terms of bug bugtivity, bug, you know, the bugs? And it looks like there's a issue with battery life. Like I, there's an article out there saying that people are having issues and I read some of the comments and it looks like some of the people are getting like one to two hours less of battery life than they usually do. I'll put the article down below if you want to read it. Um, some people are just having issues with like playing back music um, or within other apps just not working at all. So I guess the main thing I wanted to mention is that, you know, if 5.1 comes out for you as much as you might want to get it, be prepared for some bugginess within apps and within the operating system itself, but also big battery drain, which could hinder your experience and your love of the software. And this stuff always tends to happen and then they usually push an update out or two and it eventually fixes it. They might not push that update out though for another two, three, four weeks, maybe longer, based on when you got the update already for 5.1. They might push it out the next week, but usually I feel like they don't do them those that quickly. It usually takes a bit more time than that. So something to keep in mind that if 5.1 does come out, you might wanna hold off on getting it due to some issues with it in terms of battery life and uh, just bugginess in other apps and, and the operating system in general. Let me know if you have it and if you have any issues at all on your non S23 phone in the comments down below. Have a great day. We will see you down the road. Peace.